Well, you may have noticed quite a few construction crews out and about in the College Station and Bryan areas lately. From new hotels and restaurants, new construction seems non-stop in the Brazos Valley. But as KAG's HD News reporter Ian Smith shows us, there's more than meets the eye when it comes to this growth. Hey! All across College Station and Bryan, there's no shortage of places to stay thanks to an abundance of new rooms. It's new business, new opportunity, and uh, what we have now is a new inventory of hotel rooms. Rooms that signal growth across the region. We actually set a record last year with single family home permits. We issued 753 permits for single family homes, and that's just the city of College Station. Construction cones are a pretty common sight around town, especially as new development takes shape. But beyond the hotels, restaurants, and even shopping, there lies one thing, and that is infrastructure. Whether it's streets or sewer mains or water mains, I mean, all that stuff supports growth. Illustrating the need for infrastructure, construction business owner Mark Dudley has seen an influx of new projects. If you're not building infrastructure to keep up with the population that you're expecting to have, then you're going to have problems. One of the tasks Dudley's company has taken on is a new water transmission line at Villa Maria and 2818. This is a large diameter trunk uh, water line coming into the city of College Station. It's going to allow them to increase their capacity by 10 percent. And that 10 percent will expand more than just water services. It will allow for future growth, that many more homes, that many more commercial businesses. In addition to a diversified economy, Dudley says one small thing is a big reason for the construction boom. A great community, one that's very open to receive anybody that wants to come here. And um, so it's just friendly people, I think. In Brazos County, Ian Smith, KAGS HD News. City officials say Texas A&M University, affordable housing and good business initiatives continue to fuel the current construction boom.